brought to you by Felicity and Fritz at 127 Princess Street for all of the season's fashion must-haves. Hello and welcome to Queen's TV. I'm Kat Kopiak in the Ark here with first string starting quarterback of the Queen's Varsity football team, Billy McPhee. We're so happy to have you. How are you? I'm good. Thanks for having me. Thank you for talking to us. So how long have you been playing, playing football for? Um, you know what? I've been playing football since I was about six years old. What? Yeah. Just on like family or some friends? No, actually with like in an actual league. I've been playing since I was six. Like growing up in Burlington, we have like a house league type thing so uh, yeah you can basically start playing when you're five or six and like one day my buddy was just like hey my dad's coaching a football team you want to play I was like sure so I go over there and uh, I go mom can I play football with uh, my friend and uh, she's like you sure don't want to play hockey or basketball or something with less contact and I was oh yeah no I was smitten with football wow that's amazing and have you always played quarterback have you had other positions as well no I didn't play quarterback consistently till I was 14 but I've been playing quarterbacks uh, I played quarterback once when I was nine because we didn't really have anyone else to throw which is kind of funny so oh yeah I've loved it ever since it was meant to be right yeah I played linebacker once and like just I don't know I liked hitting quarterbacks but it was much more fun being a quarterback That's awesome um, so being a quarterback I can't even imagine all the pressure that you deal with do you have any special strategies or tactics on the field just to block everything out and focus on the game you know what, actually, like, ignorance is bliss to me. Like, I just try and pretend like it's just, like, me and my buddies going out there and just playing another game of football. Like, if you, if you let the surroundings get to you, obviously you're going to get nervous and you're going to play a little more uh, unrelaxed, I guess you could say. You know what I mean? You just kind of got to ignore everybody that's, that's, you know, obviously I appreciate the fan support, yeah. and it's nice when they're cheering, for the other, exactly. cheering against the other guys, but, I mean, at the end of the day, you just kind of got to focus on the game, and if you, that's basically all I do. Exactly, and actually, what's it like playing in front of 4,000 insanely spirited Queen students? You know what, it's like nothing I've ever experienced. Like, I, uh, when I was in high school, I think the most I ever played in front of was like 1,000 people or something, which is a fair amount for high school, but yeah, yeah, I want, like, yeah, the student support at Queen's is just unbelievable. Like, that's one of the reasons I decided to come here. Yeah, are we a good audience? Oh, absolutely. I came, uh, came to watch a game in 09 when they played York for the, uh, the foe coming. And it was just, I think it was like a packed house, like 10,000 people. And I was like, wow, this place is for me. Awesome. So did you always know that you wanted to go to Queens? Well, I, almost. I uh, actually, I originally went to uh, Waterloo, but then uh, the steroid scandal hit. Yeah, so Queens was kind of, I always wanted to go to Queens. It was a very tough decision when I decided to uh, go to Waterloo. But then obviously they kind of made the decision for me. Oh, really? Yeah. So. Well, we're glad you're here now. Yeah, so am I. So what are practices like? How often do you practice? Well, we practice uh, three times a week, Tuesday to Thursday. Uh, we watch film Sunday, Monday, and then Friday we kind of have what we call like a walkthrough. So it's it's not an actual practice. We just kind of go over last minute things like that. Um, but I mean, practices are tough. They're enduring. You know, they're about two hours long. We every day is a football day. We spend maybe four or five hours around the football field. Um, but yeah, that's quite the commitment. So how do you balance football and school life? Well, I mean, football is five hours of school, or sorry, five hours of your day. But I mean, the rest of the day, really, you can focus on school. It's not overly difficult, especially if you have classes in the morning. You know, that's usually what I try and do is try and pick classes that are in the morning, and that we can still be extremely successful. So I guess you guys are going into the game on Saturday versus Laurier 0 and 2, and I'm sure you have a plan to bounce back. What's your mindset uh, going into face Laurier? You know what, I was uh, just telling some people the other uh, day is that every game's a must win to me. So, you know, people make it sound like it's desperate when you say it's a must win, but to me there's nothing wrong with saying it's a must win because I'm a competitor, so every game's a must win to me. Good for you. Yeah, thanks. I'm excited. So am I. Do you have a, a message for the Laurier Golden Hawks? You know what, they're competitors and I'm looking forward to playing them. Good, all right, so thank you so much for your time, Billy. It was an honor to have you with us. We wish you the best of luck and we'll be rooting there for you. Brought to you by Felicity and Fritz, showing their love with 10% off for students year-round.